Hi everyone, welcome back to my channel. It's me, Celine, and today's video is going to be a what I eat in a weekend. But before we get into that, I'm going to share with you guys probably one of the best hauls I've ever posted on this channel. We have a huge package from today's sponsor. So thank you, Yami, for sponsoring this video. On yamibuy.com, you can buy a bunch of different Asian products, not just food. They also have home, beauty, wellness items. But you guys know me, I literally bought just food. <laughs> this box is filled to the top, so let's get into it. Starting with the most important category, the snacks. Not even exaggerating, I was browsing the snacks on Yummy Buy for over an hour. The options are endless and you know when it comes to Asian snacks, there's just so many unique and different flavors. First, we got this Lay's Roasted Garlic Oyster Flavor Potato Chips. And then I've had these before and I absolutely love them. They are turtle chips. The original is so good, but this flavor right here, the Flaming Lime Flavor Turtle Chips, they are the best. They are so good and I can not find them anywhere. So I'm excited that it was on Yummy Buy. Then I have this jelly that's peach flavor. Pretty sure I tried this before and I just decided to get it again because I remember it being good. The next category is instant. Anything instant is my best friend. Uh, I am a busy PhD student and content creator. So anything I can make in less than 10 minutes is amazing. First, I had to stock up on the essentials. I've shown these on my channel before, but they are instant rice. They're Korean rice and they're so yummy. You just microwave them for a minute and 30 seconds and you have delicious like fluffy rice. Then we have this by the same brand. It also comes with a cup of the instant rice, but it is soft tofu stew. That's instant. You can make it in less than four minutes and I love soft tofu stew. I make it all the time, but the fact that this is done in less than four minutes amazes me then we got instant hot pot and this is not just instant it is self-heating which is amazing like if you were to go camping i don't go camping but like if i were to lose electricity or something then we got our instant cafe soda or vietnamese coffee i love vietnamese coffee it's one of my favorite coffees so if this tastes like authentic and like the real stuff that would be great it comes with 10 packs and i believe it's like a powder that you just mix with hot water last instant thing which isn't really instant is um the japanese curry mix this is the golden curry i'm so excited to make it this weekend for you guys um then i have some jang and i ha i don't know why i bought this huge container just for myself but i guess this will come in handy when i am having kbbq for one last but not least i have this huge bag like so huge um bag of sweet potato noodles and this is what they used to make japchae i was craving japchae so i was like let me try to make that at home i'm excited i think i'm gonna make this today and look at this picture it looks delicious so that is everything i got from yummybuy.com if you're interested in any of these items i got like you want to try them with me or um you want to try any other asian products from food to beauty to wellness to home. And then I have a coupon code for you. New users can use Celine10 to get $10 off their first purchase. And if you're already a Yummy Buy user, I still got you. You can use Celine99 for $10 off of $99 or more. And again, thank you Yummy for sponsoring this video. Let's get into it.
having a little late night snack. This is my favorite, favorite ice cream of all time. I could eat this whole thing. This is actually a new one because I did eat the last one from my last like what i ate in a day video again this is the milk bar cereal milk ice cream so the ice cream tastes like cereal milk and then it has a bunch of crunchy cornflake pieces and i am a huge texture girl well not even texture just like crunchy like anything crunchy i love um so this ice cream i absolutely love mm. it's so good it's so 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 good the only thing is is that it's a little pricey for ice cream but it's so good i just have to splurge morning everyone i am about to try this jelly drink pretty good really sweet and a lot harder to like suck up than i remember i just toasted an everything bagel and i'm going to be Writing some cream cheese on it and this is gonna be like a quick breakfast it's kind of early so I'm not like super super hungry in the morning I'm also gonna head to a coffee shop to get some work done I love oops I love going to coffee shops on weekends it just feels like way more relaxed um, and I just love it so yeah I'm going to a new coffee shop I've never been to, which is always exciting. It looks really cute. It just has weird hours. Um, it's only open 8 to 2, which like sometimes I don't get productive until like 3 p.m. So luckily today, I am up a little earlier so I can actually go try out their coffee. But yeah, I'm just going to eat this before I go. Sometimes a simple cream cheese and like bagel is like so good. I'll see you at the coffee shop. <laughs> guys this is the most extra thing i've ever done but it is also like the cutest thing i've ever made this is usually like a really easy meal if you don't like mold a bear and cut out pieces of seaweed to um, make eyes i'm excited to eat i'm like starving now i also cut out little shapes in the carrots which was absolutely pointless because you can't really even tell whenever it's in the curry but i just wanted to try out my little fruit cutter so you know you don't have to do that either, it saves a lot of time. It's very good. Here's my dinner. I'm eating curry again for dinner. I did not shape it into a bear this time. And then I just have some fruit water and I'm gonna watch some Netflix. Having some turtle chips. 
I swear these are like the best chips ever. Look at all the layers. They're so light and crispy. Mm. Everyone say hi to Benny. I finally decided what my next read is gonna be. It's gonna be Beach Read by Emily Henry. Took me a while to decide when, when I say a while, like a day, <laughs> because last week I was unwell and I read three books, um, which is like insane for me to do that. But I guess I was just escaping life. And there's Benny again. <laughs> Happy Sunday, everyone. I am trying my instant Vietnamese coffee. It's not bad. I think it could be stronger. I'm actually not sure if I put the right amount of liquid. Maybe I put too much. So maybe that's why it's not as strong. Or maybe I could put two packets in one cup. I don't know if that would be too much. But I could definitely taste like the Vietnamese coffee flavor, but I would just like it a little bit stronger. Definitely not bad for an instant coffee. I think today is going to be a pretty chill day. I'm going to go run a few errands, but besides that, I'm probably just going to be like super lazy at home. Uh, you can hear my stove right now because I am heating up some oil. I'm making a silken tofu like chili oil dish. So I already prepped my tofu and then I cut up some garlic and green onions. So let me show you how it's done. Into the little ceramic, we're gonna add some garlic. And then I'm gonna add the white part of my green onion. I'm gonna add some sesame oil. Oh no, I'm almost out though. Some salt, some soy sauce. I'm really just eyeing it here. Korean red pepper flakes, cause this is just what I have. I'm also gonna add some of this crunchy garlic chili oil because I love the flavor of this. Now I'm gonna add some of the oil. Now we got some homemade chili oil. It smells really good. And now I'm gonna grab my tofu and put this on top. Fresh green onions. And that is done, you just eat it with rice. And of course today I'm using my instant rice I got on Yummy Bai. It's so fluffy. You can also do this with firm tofu, I just prefer silken tofu. It's so good. The tofu is cold. I've seen some people steam it, but honestly, it's just so like refreshing when it's cold. This tofu is so good and like so easy to make. I recommend it for everyone. You can definitely make this in like 10 minutes or probably less like five minutes. I'm gonna finish my first meal of the day and then I'll see you whenever. <laughs> So it's not a proper weekend unless I order some food delivery. I've had a lazy Sunday and oh no, this is like bent. And I deserve to treat myself on my last day of the weekend. I had a huge craving for birria tacos. Here they are, they smell so good. This is a dangerous thing to eat in bed. And then this is the consomme. I hope I'm saying that properly got some Dr. B. Here it is, the queso burrito. Yum. I'm gonna put some lime and some of the green sauce on it. Dip it in the consomme. Mmm! It's so good! 
and it is so crunchy too. So this is probably the last thing I'm going to eat this weekend because it is Sunday night. So thank you so much for spending the weekend with me and Benny. And I hope you enjoyed this video. We'll see you next time.